Hello, I'm Booney Drew, the Van Dweller. Today is March 29th, 2022. I'm sitting here in a uh, in a mall parking lot. If, if there's no strict security, I've stayed overnight here before. You know, they don't bother you. It depends on which city you're in, I guess. I've got vinyl uh, covers on my window. It allows you to, to see out, not the front windows, the back ones. It allows you to see out without people seeing in. So I've seen like them come in their little security buggy and, you know, kind of take a close look at me, at my van, but I haven't gotten any knocks yet. But you know, I'm parked right next to this McDonald's over here. So I might just look like a McDonald's employee because this is a 24 hour McDonald's. It's best to have, you know, multiple places that you can stay and kind of rotate them, you know? And I converted this, uh, this 2006 Dodge Grand Caravan. I'll probably do a proper van tour soon but it's nice today so it's gonna it's gonna rain it's raining in the sky I'm not staying full time in the van yet but I'm about to take a trip and I'll be documenting you know what it's like to dwell in a van. The van is where I dwell, and I dwell very well. I'm getting sleepy, I might take a nap. And maybe I'll head home. It's been warm all day. I think the high was 90. But you know, now it's pretty cool. It actually feels nice in here. I didn't intend to fall asleep right here. But you know, sometimes you gotta take sleep where you can. If you have insomnia like I do. Are finally able to sleep. It's nice just to be able to just crawl in the back. Yeah, turn the fan on. I slept a solid five hours right now. goes that way sometimes. <sighs> I was unable I was unable to sleep all of yesterday. I maybe got an hour. And uh, I had to come here to do something. And when I was done I just thought, you know, I just felt suddenly drowsy, like it's, it's like it finally came. It's like the gold rush finally came in. And I knew that I just had to seize, I had to seize on that opportunity. I thought, you know, rather than drive home 
and try to put myself to sleep. I could, I'll, I'll just, I'll just hop in the back right here, and you know, I've got a solid five hours of sleep. It's weird how it, you know, sometimes sleep will, won't just, it just runs from you, and then when it finally comes close, it gives you like a, it kind of woos you. You got to catch her, and you got to lay down with her. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Now it's middle. It's three in the morning. I'm gonna go ahead and head home. I made sure I made my bed. I like it to be neat, even though it's not. It's not a house. I just, if you keep everything put away and in its place and tidy, it just feels homier. But yeah, I mean that's a that's one of the benefits to having a bed in your van. You could just take a nap anywhere. You know. Napping is cool.